a hands-on look at iOS 16 Beta 6. What is up everybody, Jeff Benjamin with Cellular. This is iOS 16 Developer Beta 6, and as we inch closer and closer to the final release of iOS 16, hopefully we'll see less features and changes. But there are a few updates I wanna to showcase to you. For instance, if you go into the notification center while in landscape mode, you'll see a new two up display here with the clock on one side of the interface. On the right side, you have your notifications, you have your now playing interface for your music. Uh, so that's a nice two up display here. And uh, remember, this is not the lock screen, it's just Notification Center. So if you, for instance, tap on the album artwork, it's just basically going to take you to the music app or whatever is actually playing that music. But I like it, especially with the updated clocks on iOS 16. What do you guys think? Let me know down below in the comments. Now, let's briefly talk about another update here in Beta 6. And this one's actually a pretty welcome one. If you go to Settings and you go to Wallpaper previously, when you tap those Customize buttons, it would actually load up another set of buttons below and then you could choose customize current wallpaper or add new wallpaper, which was just kind of confusing, right? If you want to customize, now you just tap it. It takes you directly into the customization where you can change up the color, change up your widgets, your clock, etc. So it's just a little less confusing, less buttons thrown your way. You tap customize and you customize. Simple, straightforward, to the point. So what do you guys think about that change? Let me know down below. Welcome change in my opinion. Now let's talk about the sort of the flagship feature of beta five. And that was of course the return of the battery percentage in the status bar feature that was removed with the release of the iPhone 10 several years back. So now if you go into settings battery, you have the option to of course enable that battery percentage as you see right there. Uh, when I discussed that pretty in depth in the previous video, so be sure to check that out. But now when you go into low power mode, notice, you can have the battery percentage either on or off in low power mode. Previously, it forced you to keep the battery percentage enabled when low power mode was enabled. So now let's talk about another change here briefly. If we go into the lock screen, you can see the now playing interface with our music. If you tap the album artwork, you'll notice that the album artwork is back to the smaller size, as you can see there, that it was a few betas back. Uh, and I actually like that change. Now, for this one, I want to go into settings general and I want to reset my home screen layout to the default layout. And you'll notice something slightly different. I'm going to reset the home screen. So this will set your home screen back to the default layout. And notice the fitness app now is nestled between iTunes store and watch. So fitness is now a permanent staple on the home screen. Even if you don't own or have an Apple watch paired, you can still benefit from some of the fitness features in iOS 16. So that was a brief look at iOS 16 developer beta 6. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. This is Jeff with Cellular.